Tsunami is a series of ocean waves with extremely long wavelengths and high energy, often caused by underwater earthquakes or volcanic eruptions. Understanding the formation of tsunamis involves delving into the processes that lead to their generation, propagation, and devastating impact on coastal regions. In this detailed exploration, we will examine the key factors contributing to tsunami formation, emphasizing the geological events that trigger these formidable natural phenomena. 1. Geological Triggers The majority of tsunamis are initiated by geological events, with underwater earthquakes being the most common trigger. When tectonic plates beneath the Earth's surface shift and release accumulated stress, it can result in an earthquake. Submarine earthquakes, those occurring under the ocean floor, have a particular significance in tsunami formation. The sudden movement of the Earth's crust during these events displaces large volumes of water, setting the stage for the creation of destructive tsunami waves. 2. Submarine landslides. In addition to earthquakes, submarine landslides can also instigate tsunami formation. When underwater slopes become unstable due to factors such as volcanic activity, sediment saturation, or tectonic forces, large masses of material can rapidly slide into the ocean. This displacement of water creates waves that propagate across the ocean, evolving into tsunamis. 3. Volcanic eruptions. Volcanic eruptions, especially those occurring beneath the ocean, have the potential to generate tsunamis. When a volcano erupts, it can displace water through various mechanisms, such as the collapse of volcanic island flanks or the explosive release of gas and debris. The resulting disturbance in the water column initiates tsunami waves that radiate outward from the eruption site. 4. Plate tectonics and tsunamis. Understanding the dynamics of plate tectonics is crucial to comprehending tsunami formation. The Earth's outer shell, or lithosphere, is divided into tectonic plates that constantly move, interact, and subduct beneath one another. Subduction zones, where one tectonic plate descends beneath another, are frequent locations for powerful earthquakes that can trigger tsunamis. The sudden uplift or subsidence of the seafloor during these events displaces water and generates tsunami waves. 5. Generation of tsunami waves. When a geological event occurs, whether it's an earthquake, submarine landslide, or volcanic eruption, it imparts energy to the water column above. This energy is transferred to the water molecules, causing them to move in a circular motion. Initially, the waves may have a relatively small amplitude and travel at high speeds across the open ocean, often undetected by ships due to their long wavelengths. 6. Wave Characteristics Tsunami waves exhibit distinct characteristics that set them apart from regular ocean waves. While typical waves have short wavelengths and low energy, Tsunamis possess exceptionally long wavelengths that can stretch hundreds of kilometers. Despite their low amplitudes in deep water, tsunamis can travel at speeds exceeding 700 kilometers per hour, making them formidable and challenging to predict accurately. 7. Open Ocean Propagation As tsunami waves propagate across the open ocean, their low amplitudes make them difficult to detect without specialized equipment. In the deep sea, the wave heights may be only a few centimeters and the intervals between successive waves can be as long as 20 minutes. This characteristic makes tsunamis different from the more frequent and shorter period wind-generated waves. 8. Coastal Amplification As tsunamis approach shallower coastal waters, their dynamics change significantly. The decrease in water depth causes the tsunami waves to slow down, but their long wavelengths result in an increase in wave height. This phenomenon, known as coastal amplification, is responsible for the devastating impact of tsunamis on coastlines. The waves can rapidly transform from seemingly innocuous ripples in the open ocean to towering walls of water inundating coastal areas. In conclusion, tsunamis are complex natural phenomena that arise from various geological triggers, including underwater earthquakes, submarine landslides, and volcanic eruptions. The generation, propagation, and impact of tsunamis involve intricate interactions between the Earth's crust and the ocean. Understanding these processes is essential for developing effective warning systems, preparedness strategies, and mitigating the devastating effects of tsunamis on coastal communities. As our understanding of the Earth's dynamics continues to advance, so too will our ability to predict and respond to these formidable events. 
ultimately safeguarding vulnerable regions from the destructive forces of tsunami.